Good afternoon and welcome. We gather together today for something that's very familiar to us, but something that is very special as well. We come here not merely as witnesses or observers, but to partake in this really wonderful event, this couple, they who you know and love, who you care about, will make a pledge to each other today to begin a new chapter in their life. Tossed in like a castaway, what we wanted, not what we thought we wanted. Tossed in. When I first started writing this um, a year ago, I had a realization. I've known Eileen all of my life, but she's only known me for a portion of hers. <laughs> and as a result, I think I know her a little bit better than she must know about me. Um, for instance, everyone knows she's allergic to the Italian spice palette, but I am privileged to know about her weakness for Haagen-Dazs peanut butter chocolate ice cream. Everyone knows how proud she is to be a Hufflepuff, go Badgers. Loyal to her friends and hardworking to the point of burning out. Uh, and I know how she chose a name for her biggest fan and biggest love and the best investment she ever made, her dog Hazel, who couldn't be here tonight. She had a previous engagement. <laughs> I am very pleased and honored to be speaking uh, at this joyous occasion, uh, wishing Eileen and Tyler all the best for their lifetime together. And then I started thinking a lifetime. A lifetime ain't all that long. You know, as the saying goes, days are short. Days are long. Years are short. And the decades, they go by in the blink of an eye. I close my eyes here and I remember bringing Eileen home from the hospital. I open my eyes and here she is on her wedding day with this, married to this wonderful guy. And I have another son, decades later. that I know. And in this moment, I can proudly say I know one more thing. There are so many people in this room who love and support Eileen and Tyler, or Tyleen, their ship name. I cannot wait to see what married life holds for them. So, in a tradition as old as time, won't you please all join me in raising a glass to the couple before you. May your house be too small for all of your friends and may you always have love to spare. But here's a little known fact about Tyler. Tyler was born at 11.55 p.m. on May 19th. So today is May 20th. And today is the 31st anniversary of the first time I held that young man in my arms. This young man helped raise me. It was just him and I since the age of two for him. Now, I get to turn my most valuable possession over to you. And he could not have made a better choice. I've never been good at telling stories. 